Take some deep breaths. Fresh air will help you. It's gonna be okay. Not for Spinelli. He's in there fighting for his life because of me. Because I couldn't keep my mouth shut and I had to piss Lisa off. Uh, look, Ma Lisa's crazy, Maxie. Nothing you did or said was gonna change anything she was already gonna do. She had this really bizarre look on her face. Like, like she was happy. Like threatening to shoot all of us was as easy as taking a stroll through the county fair. Yeah, she snapped tonight in a big way. And her target was Robin and Patrick and you just were in the wrong place at the wrong time. No, Lisa hates me too. I've talked trash about her to anyone who would listen. I knew what kind of person she was right from the start. I mean, her lame attempts to seduce Patrick, it was pathetic. I knew she was trouble. I just didn't know she was this kind of trouble. I mean, I would be dead right now if it wasn't for Spill. How'd he get shot? Anyway, I mean, you said she was yelling at you about your crimes or something? Yeah, she was acting like a judge and jury, singling us each out one at a time, and then I, I, I lost it. Why, what'd you do? I called her a crazy bitch. She, she raised her gun like she was gonna shoot me, and that's when Spinelli fell down from the vent. You fell? Yeah, he fell right between me and Lisa. So was she decided just to shoot him? No. That was the second time I wouldn't shut up. I was yelling at Lisa to leave Spinelli alone, and I guess she just couldn't take it anymore. Because she lifted her gun, and then she really did shoot. But Spinelli, um, he jumped in front of me, and it hit him instead. And then he fell to the floor, and he was bleeding really bad. Um, Lisa really wouldn't let anyone help him. Spinelli was laying there, dying, and she didn't care. I was with you, I was pretty pissed off with Spinelli for going up into those air ducts because he was supposed to be on a computer finding the access code to get us into the building. But uh, after you just told me what you told me about him getting shot, I realized if he hadn't done what he did, you, he probably wouldn't be alive. Of course this would happen. Right when I thought I didn't have to worry about him anymore. What do you mean? The whole time Spinelli and I were together, I was always so freaked out that he was going to do something to try to impress me and wind up getting himself hurt or killed in the process. He was always trying to prove what a man of action he was. And I know it's because he thought that's what I wanted. And now you broke up with him, you didn't think you'd have to worry about him anymore. I thought if he wasn't in love with me anymore. He wouldn't feel the need to take chances to prove himself to anyone. Then he would be safe. But I was wrong. Because tonight he showed up to save me anyway. I know that you were shot point blank in the chest and you survived, but Spinelli's not quite as strong as you. <laughs> Maxie? He's okay. It was tricky, but he's gonna be fine. Hey, 